happening, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Andy Rulo's Road to the Show! My name is Andy. Welcome to my channel, Andy Rulo. Uh, Andy Rulo, my guy, up there with his new Griffey cleats. Yeah, shout out. He's got the Griffey bat, he's got the Griffey cleats, and he's got the Griffey swing, baby! He's got the power! It's all there! Oh, my goodness! That was his 37th home run on the season, I believe. That means, uh, I think, his uh, 70th ribby and, uh, oh, 71st ribby. Just kidding. All right. Didn't realize that there was somebody on pace. <laughs> I don't know. I'm just up there to hit. <laughs> I'm not actually paying attention to that sort of stuff, you know. But Rulo has been on an absolute tear uh, since being called up to AAA. We're in mid-August right now. So, uh, yeah, that's the deal. That's the deal. AAA. Tacoma Rainiers for the Seattle Mariners organization. One of these days, I'm going to be called up. I'm going to be called up any day now. All right, I got a 16-game hitting streak. Uh, now I believe a 17-game hitting streak. I've been in 17 games since uh, uh, being called up. And uh, I have gotten a hit in every single one of those. Um, and almost a home run in every single one of those. That's going to go ahead and be a nice... Good old-fashioned double right there. You love to see it, don't you? Don't you just love that? It's so cool. I'm stoked. Yeah, Rulo, we're like, uh, so stoked to be Rulo right now. All right, um, stolen bases. He's not excellent at stealing uh, right now. But uh, you know what? I'm going to do my darndest to be a better stealer of the bosses. And, yeah, there we go. That's a good jump. It's a good old-fashioned jumpity jump right there. Nice. Um, I got some plus speed with these Griffey cleats, so that's cool. I got some uh, power in the bat, and I also got a new glove. I haven't gotten a chance really to show that off yet, but I got a nice new Nike glove, and that should give me some more um, attributes. I forget exactly which ones, but, you know. Rulo, he's got, a, he's got a whole new look to him these days, and that is a run scored by me. Evan White goes ahead and grounds out there. And, uh, oh, my goodness. I uh, apparently am never going to field in this game. This is the second, you no, know, this is the uh, fifth game, I believe, in a six-game series against the Albuquerque Isotopes here at home. And then we are on to Salt Lake to face the bees, buzz, buzz, um, the angels. Ew, gross, angels, Ugh, I don't like it, I don't like it at all. All right, Rulo, here we go. Um, it's five to four right now, and oh, they don't want you to steal, but guess what? They're not gonna get you, bro. Here we go, look at this. We're being aggressive, we're being very very, very aggressive. Come on. Come on. Look at that acceleration. Oh, we're going to go ahead and continue on to third base. Thanks very much. All right. There you go, Evan White. You're putting it all together finally. He had a little snowflake next to his name in the lineup, and uh, um, I think that means that he's just been ice cold. But, hey, a couple RBIs in this game. Or uh, at least one RBI. He scored me uh, an RBI uh, ground out to first base or whatever, or wherever he grounded out to. I forget. Uh, and yeah, he just advanced me to third base so with a hit. And so that's so freaking neat. I just thought that was just the neatest thing ever. All right, Rulo. He's, like I said, Waiting for the call, all right? He's uh, done nothing but contribute. Um, maybe lost once or twice. Ooh, hit him right in the rump. Oh, he's mad. He's mad about it. They should allow people to charge the mound um, in this game. That would be pretty cool. Take the bat with you. Do some GTA style. You know, smack him around a little bit, you know? That's what needs to happen one of these times. And, uh, whoa, 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 what happened there? Oh, strikeout. I, I thought he hit another batter for some reason. Uh, he did not. So here we are. And that's two outs, so I better start running. And that's it. I don't know why I'm doing this for it. I wasn't even holding my helmet down. That's a dub. That's a good old-fashioned W. You love to see it. We're going to play this last game, I think, of this series, unless... 
they say that the series has ended, but I can't imagine they will. <laughs> Here we go. I do like those isotopes jerseys. Those are actually pretty sick. The Albuquerque isotopes. So my brother-in-law works for the high A affiliate for the Angels. Um, my hometown, the Tri-City Tri -City Dust Devils. They used to be the Padres and the Colorado Rockies. So Russell Wilson was actually a second baseman for the Tri-City Dust Devils before he became a Seattle Seahawk, which is crazy. Um, he was drafted by the Rockies. Um, and then we had like Fernando Tatis Jr. and Ty France when they were in the Padres organization, which uh, is pretty neat. And uh, yeah, so I think that's pretty cool. And why am I talking about this? Anyway, yeah, my brother-in-law works for them. He's the on-field. Holy, holy host. Yeah. Pull job. Pull job. Pull job. Pull job, baby. Oh, yeah, I love myself a good old-fashioned polljob.org right there. Backslash Rulo. Yeah, yeah. Um, anyways, uh, so, yeah, he's the on-field host. He's obsessed with minor league baseball. He's been to, like, a, over 100 minor league parks, and he gets a hat from each stadium. Um, and I got to ask if I'm assuming he has an Albuquerque Isotopes hat. Um, I wonder if he's ever been to that stadium. I don't know. I got to ask him. Um, probably he usually will like every summer he'll go to like a region of the country and just he'll literally like map out all the different minor league parks there and he'll try to either attend a game or take a tour or you know go just go visit the stadium to just buy a hat um, I think that's his rule if he bought if he visits the stadium he buys a hat oh and if I get a pitch if I get pitched to I hit dingers whoa did that one hit the other pole was that a light pole job? Was that a light pole job? Hold on. Hold on. Where did it land? Where did it land? That thing went so far. Yes, give me this angle. Show, show the flight. Show the flight of the ball. Oh, come on. Come on. Here we go. Here's something. Did that get off the pole? That was off the light post, I think. It was. I heard a dinging right there. Hold up. Hold the phone. We got to look at this one. We got to look at this one. Right here, 429 foot dinging, dinging, dong. And we're following the flight of the ball into. Oh, two pole jobs! Two pole jobs, one game. One pole job right there. Ding, right off the lamp. The light post, whatever you want to call it. It's not a lamp post. That's a silly thing to say. Woo! All right, double pole job here. Um, sick let's get back to the game i'm batting from the left side now two home runs i'm two for two killing the game right now and that is just gonna be a regular old single <laughs> whatever bro okay but it is four to nothing i love it i love it and i feel like i'm good and fast in these ken griffey jr cleats so let's take a little bit of a secondary lead and not just kidding just kidding they're keeping an eye on me these days. Okay. All right. Come on. Pick up that front foot, and I'm off to the races. The races. I'm off to them, and we're in there. Woo! 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 Here we go. We're going to do it again. We're going to do it again. We're going to do it again. Lift up that front foot, buddy. Yeah. Oh, that might not have been a great pitch. I'm out. I am out. I am out. I am out, and I am sorry for my terrible base running. <laughs> okay, here we go. Albuquerque Isotopes. I do not know who that the that is the AAA affiliate for. Um, who is near Albuquerque? No, it's not. Is it the Astros? It's not the Astros. I know Texas is Round Rock. Uh, and maybe it is. Maybe it is the Astros. In which case, ew. I got to beat the Astros here. I'm three for three. The single and a couple of ding-dongs. You love to see that. Um, I customized the cleats. I liked the black with the teal because Ken Griffey Jr. had some high-top Nike cleats, which he hand-painted the Nike logo teal. Oh, that was perfectly hit. And, 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 and,
dead center, not dead center scoreboard, but pretty freaking deep left center. 415 off of, I did it hit off that? I don't know if it did actually, but that's a dub. And we're going to call it right there, folks. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the very next episode of Andy Rulo's Road to the Show. Peace.